So this was, this was my job when I first got to New York. I worked for CBS News as a drawer for them. Like this is a drawing I did for a famous murder, kidnapping of a guy. And it led to these kinds of jobs where I do a recreation for People magazine of the Patty Hearst kidnapping. And there she is, being forced down on the floor. That's a symbol of the group that kidnapped her. That I think is the Symbionese Liberation Army. And um, there's another drawing of her practicing with a gun going back and forth. And these are all in place in this mock-up they made. There's the army and they're, they went into uh, banks and robbed them and stuff, waving guns around and yelling. And there's Patty Hearst again being stuffed in a trash can. I had to have my friend Skip push my sister in a trash can to uh, have models to draw this from, because you have to draw from life kind of. All the neighbors thought I was a little strange because they were looking in the window. I had all, all these lights on and no shades. It took a while to get over that one. There she is again. She was stuffed in a closet for a long time. And then they took the blindfolds off. And she said it was very weird. It was very abstracted and people leering in and out. So I wanted to try to get that feeling in these drawings of strange after uh, being blinded for so long. There she is back with her husband. That's a photograph, of course. She was an heiress to his vast fortune. William Randolph Hearst was her grandfather, I think. So that's all. It's a good job. Got me out of the studio. Fun to do. Thanks for looking.